Good afternoon, gang. You should be able to hear me just fine. Got little Billy, Sir William, and Big Bill, and over here on Big Bill's seat is a package and a little bit of irony. And the reason why I decided to shoot with the three Bills is because this is from Bill. So let's get the camera mounted back here. And let's get that open. Bill, I want to thank you. Uh, it had a little bit of a delay. It was supposed to be here Saturday. And... I wasn't able to make it to the post office yesterday, but I did make it to the post office this morning. And in making it to the post office this morning, it was in there. And he told me what it was going to be, but I'll keep that quiet and just let you guys see it. At the same time, I believe I know which one it is, but I'm not positive. We'll see here just directly. And I'm looking for a note. I don't see a note, but that's okay. Using the oh so sweet, thanks to Jeff Kennedy. Tucked in the pocket. Let's see what we got. Let's see what we got. Let's see what we got. What do you think, guys? How about that? Isn't that awesome? The Camel 8 Ball. I have never had this one, Bill. That is really nice. I like that. I like it a lot. It uh, appears to be enamel. Neat. I really like that. That's going to look awesome out there in my display case. And uh, I won't be in the shop today. And the announcement that I'm going to make, I was going to make this past weekend. But as luck would have it, uh, the weekend wound up being busier than anticipated. So... It did not happen. But rest assured, it's a worthy announcement. I know. I'm killing you guys, making you wait. A couple people have guessed, so if you go to my <clears throat> excuse me, go to my previous video and um look at the uh comments, you will see that I did let the cat out of the bag in the comments. So if you're not sure what's going on and you want to, that's really nice. I like that. Yeah, I've never had, um, never had this one. I had, uh, when you said uh, Joe Camel and Pool, I assumed uh, you were talking about the matte purple lighter that had Joe Camel actually shooting Pool on the front. But... I have seen this one in the past and really liked it. And obviously you guys know that I do have a pool table. So I'm going to come out here and uh, this is for, uh, I believe it's Bo, B-O-O, -O, Bo, down in Louisiana. Wanted to show him uh, my pool table a little bit better. You guys have seen my canes on it. But this is uh, my old housing classic. And I bought it second hand. It's a three piece, one inch slate. Heavy sucker. We'll go ahead and set that right down there. But I figured I'd show you guys the whole pool table. And bumper pool would have fit in here just perfect without having to use short sticks. But uh, 
I do have these troubleshooter sticks and they're properly weighted. Of course the balance is different on them, but I've got these troubleshooter sticks. I'll show you here lengthwise. Even down there and we come down here and they allow me to shoot in the tight spots. But there's really only a couple of tight spots down here. So it's not too bad. Yep, I'd say that's a that's a pretty table. Had the dining room table in here for years. Used it maybe three times a year. I'm going to put that in my pocket so that I don't misplace it. Bill, again, thank you very, very, very much for that. Um, I love my lighters. I looked for a note and didn't see one. If there is one in there, I will dig through again and see. Uh, this is my military McDermott has all the branches of the military in there. Well, almost. For whatever reason, they always seem to forget to put the Coast Guard in. They've got the Navy, the Marines, and the Air Force, and the Army, but they don't have <laughs> the National, the, the uh, did I say National Guard? I meant Coast Guard. If I didn't say Coast Guard, I meant Coast Guard. But Coast Guard's definitely a branch of the military, so. But there's that one. And then over here on the wall, we have a couple more really nice McDermott's. We'll pull them down, take a quick look at them. This one has uh, ivory inlay with uh, uh, onyx. And then these are kind of hard to see. Let's go down to the big ones. Inlaid birds, there's a robin and a cardinal and a blue jay that's a really nice stick too from 1992 you can see uh, what the stick cost back in 1992 those are the original stickers on it um, it is a used stick but just very very gently used then we have this stick here and it the name of it uh, escapes my memory, but it's quite rare because it was a custom order. It's also a McDermott. The reason that, m that it makes it rare is because it was a custom order. But you can see the bird's eye maple here, that it has just uh, been clear coated over. And this one's been stained. Well, this stick, in its original as bought stage stage would have been just cleared it would not have been stained also see that this has a linen wrap this cue would have also had linen wrap but it was special ordered with a leather wrap and a darker stain and also a quick release um, this one has purple heart wrapped by black onyx with ivory inset and then down here we have ivory and mother of pearl and there are three one two three we come down here we have more mother of pearl and ivory with sterling bands there mother of pearl and <clears throat> ivory with sterling bands there as well and a stainless butt joint beautiful beautiful stick I like my sticks but in the event that I go to uh, a rough bar this is a regular house cue that I took and I put a piece of beach right down in there so that I could be sure to locate the queue in the same position all the time and I made it a sneaky peat so and it's also my brake stick then we have a Hubler Silver Jubilee Silver Jubilee 
and Paul Hubler uh, is no longer with us. Made in the USA, but he was of German descent. <clears throat> this is a 1973 and 1998 25-year anniversary queue. Uh, not the most expensive silver jubilee made. In fact, it was the least expensive ever made. Um, but I used this stick for many, many, many years. Wonderful, wonderful stick. Just a uh, black and foil linen wrap. But wonderful, wonderful cue stick. And I still use all these, with the exception of that one. I preserve that one. Then we've got uh, uh, Earl Strickland jump break. It splits right here, so you can use a jump stick or a short stick if you're caught somewhere. Uh, just another Q uh, Tech. I think it's a Jubilee. And I've had a couple of other sticks. Uh, I think it's Players that is the low end McDermott that you can get for 40 50 bucks I had some of those but have since uh, given those to people getting started in the billiards getting getting into billiards but the one that I use most often is the one that was already on the table and that would be my military pool cue so to all, all of you that have served thank you very very much I mean I served myself but uh, Everybody deserves a recognition, right? So, those are my kids. Ha ha, my kids. Actually, I think my other kid's in here. Yep, she is. There's my other kid. What you doing, kid? Here's for Robert. Hey, yo, baby girl. What you doing, baby girl? Oh, you want to you want to lick the camera? Do you want to lick the camera? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you. All right, guys, I know this is just kind of a vlog style, but we did have the wonderful unboxing. Uh, and Bill, I definitely, definitely appreciate it. And I hope you think it was uh, neat that I shared your package with the rest of the Bills in here. And yes, the Twin Star just uh, got moved in here not too long ago. Um, last week, as a matter of fact, we had a day it got up around 50 degrees, and I fired it up and brought it out here. I really like that blue. But it won't be long, and they will be back out because uh, my spring indicator is my or my crocus. And last year, my crocus bloomed on March 1st, which is only just over four weeks away or two weeks away. So, well, no, it's actually, yeah, it's right at two weeks away. Um, but at any rate, uh, Bill, my friend, thank you very, very, very much for that definitely definitely is going to be an awesome addition in the lighter case and I guess that's just about all I have for you guys so tell Big Bill Little Bill and Sir William later and tell Zippo later I'll catch you guys on the next one uh, I know it was kind of a lame one but if you would, hit that thumbs up button. Say hi, old blue and calamity. Did get my radiator in uh, Clifford the other day. Only took about 30 minutes. The same day that I put uh, Sir William in the house. But anyway, that's it. All right, thumbs up, please, guys. If you would, if you're not subscribed already, please click the subscribe for many, many, many different types of videos. And I will see you guys on the next one. Later. I'm out of here.